am here to support Jen as she tries to figure out her relationship with Rishi and their pending engagement announcement. Hello everyone, if you guys are new, hit the subscribe button down below and join the channel. Let's talk about Jen and Rishi. So on the last episode, we saw Jen hire a translator so that she can pretty much translate everything. So Jen is finally on her way with her best friend and the translator to go meet up with Rishi's family and she ends up saying that she wants to know everything everything that they talk about and the idea is for them to also tell his family about the engagement i want her to ask rishi's family the questions i have about the arranged marriage when they presented him with options how many girls they presented to him if i'm satisfied with everything that i hear then randy will also tell rishi's family that we're engaged we hear rishi say this as to what he hopes will happen I'm hoping now Jen can understand when she talked to my family that there is nothing to worried about as far as arranged marriage. And he ends up making a joke regarding the translator. It's unfortunate that the translator is uh, so young and beautiful. Maybe uh, my family, they will think that uh, they are bringing a uh, perfect match for me <laughs> along with them so right away we see jen thanking the mom for having them there and she asks how many proposals rishi has had she ends up saying two to four however rishi has not accepted them and has not been a part of that soon after that the friend steps in because i guess they didn't like the fact that the mom mentioned that because he is a model he gets to work with a lot of women जिम में इनमें बहुत वो है जो साथ काम करती है मॉडलिंग वगैरह में मॉडलिंग एंड ऑल्सो ऑब्वियसली ही इज इंटरेक्टिंग विद सम गर्ल्स बट डिड यू आई सी द फेस दैट जेन मेड टू मी दैट फेस वॉज हर टेलिंग हर लाइक हे यू नीड अ सी समथिंग अ फ्रेंड बेसिकली एंड अप सेंग दिस आई एम हियर टू सपोर्ट जेन as she tries to figure out her relationship with Rishi and their pending engagement announcement and then it gets a little bit awkward that the translator ended up having to step in however after that we do hear the mom say that if her son is happy that that is pretty much all she cares about basically approving their engagement in a way but we do hear jen say a couple of comments let's go ahead and take a look <laughs> Now, what I don't understand is if Jen really wanted his family to know about the engagement, why didn't she just do it? Like, why didn't she just say it instead of the friend? I don't understand because it seemed like the translator and the friends were the ones that were really talking. So Uncle then ends up saying that although he is happy for them, he does not like the idea of Rishi moving out of the house because he is the main provider. And if he were to leave, then they would have a problem. So Uncle is saying that he has no issue with the marriage at all, but he wants you to know that he is the main caretaker of this family if he leaves there'll be nobody to take care of them yeah and it's yeah. difficult for them it seems like they do approve of her but they want her to live there with them i'm happy that my mom say she's okay with it We do also see Rishi getting a little bit annoyed regarding Jen's comments it's frustrating me that uh, Jen told my family that uh, she don't want it to like live in a joint family i just got a uh, good vibes from my family about our relationship i don't want it to spoil it at the same moment soon after jen and her friends leave rishi ends up having a conversation with his family and although at the beginning it seemed like the mom was okay with the idea of them getting engaged she ends up saying that she is heartbroken and that they are going to need to talk to the rest of the family regarding their engagement not only my mom and uncle i have to convince to all the entire family and uh, 
So I know this is a very big thing in the Indian culture. To basically see what they think about the situation and then decide whether they do agree or they don't agree. Then the uncle ends up asking Rishi regarding Jen's age and let's just say that things took another turn. We also do see him very hesitant answering that question. Rishi, give up, man. And they did not, and I mean, they did not like the fact that she is much older than he is. Mom ends up saying that she does not support the relationship and that he basically needs to break things up and tell her that he cannot marry her. You see him have a breakdown, which I was not expecting. I lost everything. I lost every hope. And uh, Jen, like, uh, she loved me so much. And uh, he moved here. Like, uh, she did a lot for me. I love her a lot. So <sighs> that's why I'm in a very hard situation right now. And on the next episode, we do see that he does talk to Jen about his parents. But will he actually tell her that he will not be marrying her? That is the big question. When they asked about your age, they were like a totally, totally like opposite. Did they Just say no? Stop wasting my time. Do you guys think that he will do what the mom told him to do? Or do you guys think that he will be a man and step up and just say that he loves her and that he wants to be with her? Let me know down below. And as always, I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.